at 615, Riverside County Sheriff Chad Bianco finding himself in some controversy this morning. So he admits he was once a member of the Oath Keepers. Chelsea Edwards takes a closer look. Riverside County Sheriff Chad Bianco confirmed this week that he paid for a year-long membership to an extremist group called the Oath Keepers, which the FBI calls an anti-government militia. Now, some local leaders and groups are calling for his resignation. The Los Angeles chapter of the Council on American Islamic Relations says it is unacceptable and disturbing that Sheriff Chad Bianco is defending his association with the Oath Keepers, a group that is well known for its involvement with rallies promoting white supremacy, anti-black and anti-Muslim rhetoric, as well as its recent involvement with the January 6th insurrection. All of these instances make it difficult to trust a public servant who has the responsibility of protecting people, yet defends and supports a group that has endangered the public and our Constitution. Palm Springs Mayor Christy Holstage and other elected officials are making similar demands for resignation. Sheriff Bianco denies having any involvement with the January 6th breach of the U.S. Capitol and says that he is not ashamed of his involvement with Oath Keepers. Like many other law enforcement officers and veterans who were members, I learned the group did not offer me anything, and so I did not continue membership. I'm not currently a member and have not been a member since 2014. My oath is to the Constitution and laws of the land and to the people of Riverside County, who I am sworn to protect. Riverside residents have mixed opinions on whether his involvement in Oath Keepers should have any consequences now. I mean, it shouldn't matter. I mean, either way, everyone has their entitlement to their own opinion. I think that you should be held responsible for everything you do despite when you did it. Those were your beliefs then, yeah. and they might not have changed now. We're all entitled to our own decisions and our own beliefs. I may not agree with how far right they are because I'm personally not, but that's his personal belief. At that point, no one can tell him what to believe. No one can tell me what to believe. So at the end of the day, it's everyone's decision. Sheriff Bianco was elected in 2018. It doesn't appear that he has any plans to resign. Reporting from Riverside, I'm Chelsea Edwards, Fox 11 News.